are listening to the Chompcast, the 71st official Chompcast from Sword Chomp. Thanks for checking out our show. We really appreciate you wasting a few hours with us. And remember, if you want to support us here at Sword Chomp, um, please leave a kind rating wherever you listen to podcasts. Uh, share the show with your friends, whatever you can do to get the Sword Chomp name out there. Uh, remember, you can find us on almost any podcast app on Android, iTunes, of course, SwordChomp.com, YouTube, and our home bases are at Sword Chomp on Instagram and Twitter. We have a holiday spectacular of a show today as we light up the sky with a hail of gunfire as we mow down Nazis and Wolfenstein 2. Take in a final shallow gasp of Breath of the Wild before the <laughs> before game of the year. And uh, we tear through an onslaught of listener questions and emails with the same fervor as our favorite meathead, BJ Blaskowitz, would tear through an army of Nazis. Um, I'm also playing Santa this year uh, with some gifts from my close friends and fellow crew members. Uh, so we have some surprises in store for not just you, our listener, but my friends. In this case, it's it's going to be an awesome fucking show. Oh, and don't forget the bio break section of the show, the science portion, in which we are discussing kind of a fun article this week. It's the end of the year, something silly, um, but true, uh, an article about fish orgies that are damaging dolphins. Yes, you heard that right. It's it's going to be a merry, merry, merry chum cast indeed. <sighs> now, I told you you couldn't bring the dolphins anymore, fish. Yeah, but <laughs> what's? They're, they're so lovable, though. They're the most lovable. Yeah, just get a goddamn tank. <laughs> get a tank. I mean, the waterbed is not cutting it. Mm, the waterbed. You know, Josh, I thought you were going to save that joke for that section of the show, the show, but you just couldn't wait. You just couldn't wait. No, no. I, fish needs to know now because mm. there's probably a dolphin sitting in that waterbed while we're waiting and recording this show. Uh, I'll, I'll get and something needs to be done about it. I'll get a fix right now. Okay, I'll get a fix, mm-hmm. Josh. <laughs> this is clearly <laughs> making you upset. Mm-hmm. No. It's making me upset too. <laughs> Uh, you know, it's funny because Fish is actually going to do the intro today. That's my first present as the Santa of the Chomp cast. I, I have something for all of you guys today. <gasps> um, and the f- Wow. That's right, Fish. Santa is real again. <laughs> this is Thanks, real Santa. Back. Remember when your parents crushed your dreams and told you Santa wasn't real? Now it's back. We're flipping it around. Snip, snap. <laughs> Santa's real again, okay? <laughs> snip, yes. snap. Well, I was Snip, thinking of snap. that scene in the office where they yeah. he talks about getting his reverse um, vasectomies, <laughs> and then he snip snap snip snap, and then you want kids again, and then mm, you didn't want kids. Okay. Snip, you don't remember that? Okay, that's a good scene. <laughs> that was a really good scene. Okay, I, I remember that. now. Um, so we're doing the reverse vasectomies of podcasting here, um, metaphorically. So follow that one. Yeah, so yeah. I told Fish he could do the intros for today's show as my gift to him because we make fun of him all year, me in particular. But, you know, Shay and Josh are guilty by association. That's just what happens, you know. Mm-hmm. And even when I was a kid, my friend stole from the store and I got arrested as well just because I was with him. I didn't even know he was going to do it. So... You guys are guilty by association, which means Fish is taking you all down with us. Um, so I'll pass it off to you, Fish. You can do the intros for the show today, and uh, take it away, my friend. All right. Thank you. Thank you for this wonderful present. All right. <laughs> okay. Oof. Our first co-host attempted to clone himself for science, conducting rigorous tests and calculations. He mm-hmm. gathered the courage to attempt this feat but ended up with a hundred copies of himself instead of just one. He now podcasts with all of his newfound buddies, each having a turn to state a sentence before moving on to the next clone, as they all crowd around one microphone. The illustrious Shay Layton. <laughs> the fuck was that? <laughs> hello, 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 hello. It wasn't, it wasn't just for science. It was also... For the ladies, that's true. <laughs> that's the one hundred of my penises equals one normal penis. Mm-hmm. No, great. Mm-hmm. I thought we were gonna get through a whole show about dick jokes because I wasn't doing the intros. But sorry, let me show. let me redo that. I, I I didn't mention any dicks. Come on, <laughs> I'll Come cut on. that out. Just... <laughs> no, no, you always say that, and we never let you cut it out. <laughs> 
you just want to cut everything. Snip, snap, snip, snap. Um, <laughs> s- s- wait, that's a weird right. joke. There's a... What yeah, did you, you like think that? Shay wanting to clone himself I to like that a lot. Shays to podcast with? I, I don't know. It just mm, it came to weird. my head, and I thought it was funny, so I wanted to just <laughs> share that with you guys. I like uh, it. It's good. Yeah. Uh, you liked it? Okay. Good. Good. Yeah, it's my Shay, first time like I ever got an original intro. Hmm. Oh, as he trying to... Yeah. I see how it is. Uh, yeah, I noticed that Morgan has been neglecting you. I just haven't said anything. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. At least not somebody's not all of the shays. Just this particular shay who's talking right now. Yeah, so. that's true. Mm-hmm. The other ninety nine. <laughs> oh wait, that's oh, hundred. Yeah. I'm a hundred and one. I'm yeah. I'm a hundred and one shay. Ma- sh- how do you say that? Shaymations, Dalmatians. Because I'm the first, <laughs> uh-huh. and there's a hundred clones. <laughs> that- Shaylations, a hundred and one. Why wouldn't Why wouldn't you go with the obvious? A hundred and one Shaylatons. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> that's a weird joke, Josh. What if? Mm-hmm. Well, I was thinking of like the opposite. Like that's just like the the Tinder scroll from hell. Every time you swipe right, there's another Shay, 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 Shay. Just, <laughs> Could you imagine that? <laughs> Eventually, they're just gonna swipe left. Just and be like, <laughs> no, no more Shay. One hundred one slightly different poses. Yeah, different yeah. Completely. That's that's a dating in the future. Is like. There are apps, but we access them with our virtual reality mm-hmm. glasses. And it's not like a full headset, but they're just like tiny mm-hmm. spectacles. Okay. And at this point, we've gotten really into stem cell research, and we've learned how to clone ourselves effectively. And you just swipe through, and you decide which clone of the person you want. So you find the one person that you love, and you're mm-hmm. like, ah, this clone's crazy. So you go to another clone. Because they're slightly different in personality. Yeah, yeah. That's that's yeah. our future, guys. Hmm, it's interesting. Interesting. Yeah. Um, well, that's cool. Very. That's that's a, that's a nice nice little intro there, and uh, strange, okay. but that's the beauty of this. I, I knew it was going to be either amazing or a beautiful train wreck. There is no law. Lo- there's no losing for our listeners. <laughs> Only winning. Okay. All right. Uh, our second co-host is a man of the finer things in life. But not only does he partake in cigars and rare spirits, he has a unique ability to juggle the ever-dangerous act of passing gas without sharding himself and not breaking his stream of urine. That magical bastard is none other than Joshua Fowler. Jesus Christ. I'm doing <laughs> it right now. That was. These are getting weirder and weirder. I don't even want to know where this is going to go. <laughs> I'm What's wrong with this. that one? <laughs> so, so let me get this right. Josh is such a uh, a master mm-hmm. that he can pass gas without breaking a stream of urine. Mm-hmm. Fine yeah. gentleman, have Some mastery of that prostate. Have you tried that, Morgan? Like, so know, he's like whenever... a ninja of body excretion. Mm-hmm. I wouldn't say necessarily a ni- a ninja, yeah. more of like I, a, a magician, yeah. maybe. Hmm. Yeah, I have the one prostate to rule them all. Okay. The one to bind <laughs> them? What, the, uh, I was gonna In say, the darkness. I was going to say that's what she said, but that seems like a really strange context. He's got the one prostate, girls. You, you'd never know. Um, or gal, or guys, you know. We're, uh, we're equal opportunity here. Love everyone. Well, um, Are we, though? Uh, because we're all guys. We're all guys. Well, There's know. not I, an equal opportunity about that. I, I wish we. I wish sometimes we had a female perspective on the podcast, but um, this is the way it is. So True. I try to get a sex change. I, yeah, I'm trying to embrace my femininity too. Uh, okay. Uh, well, that is what whether it your is. femininity wants it or not. <laughs> just the hey now, it's it's consent. Embrace it, God damn it. <laughs> it's consensual embracing. All right. Um, all right, fish. What do you got for me? You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. <laughs> okay. Please be the lamest one ever. <laughs> Last but not and least, here's Morgan Barnes. Is a well-rounded man. His passions lie in all. Ha! Su- all. <laughs> 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 Damn it, Josh! <laughs> Keep it down while I'm introducing Morgan. <laughs> Keep it <here>. down. <laughs> okay. Start again. Start again. Start again. All right. Here we go. 
Last mm-hmm. but not least is a well-rounded man. Mm-hmm. Is Pat? Ha! <laughs> Don't let him fuck you up. Push through him, fish. Push through him. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> That was me pushing through it. His passions lie in all sorts of forms of entertainment and arts. His last endeavor, to infiltrate the Pizza Bros headquarters and climb the ranks and not stop till he has crowned, till he is crowned King Pizza Bro. <laughs> that man is none other than Morgan. That's not my fleshy mole. That's my penis. Barnes. <laughs> That's not my fleshy what? There's the dick joke. Not my fleshy what? <laughs> mole? Fleshy mole. Yeah. Oh, gross. God. I didn't think I could get any more disgusting <laughs> than my intros. And <laughs> fleshy mole. Huh. All right. Yeah. It's like a beauty mark, but you know, the opposite. Mm. A fleshy mark. So yeah, an I ugly like mark. That. Yeah. It's a pock mark. Hey. On <laughs> every woman who's ever been with him. Beauty is in the eye of the beholder, all right? Um, you don't want that in your eye. <laughs> I, I will be the supreme pizza bro. Half, the, half of our listeners are not going to get the pizza bro joke. They're going to be like, what? I don't get it. But our longtime listeners that understand the pizza jokes, they'll, they'll appreciate it. So, mm-hmm. Yeah. They just got to go back a few episodes and they'll find it. Well, How did it feel? How did it feel doing intros, Fish? Uh, it was good. I got to use uh, some of my imagination mm-hmm. and creativity. Mm. It felt good. So felt when good. we, yeah, it was nice. It's good. I mean, you forced us to use our imagination with Morgan's fleshy mm-hmm. mole, but yeah, it was I was nice. going to say we we asked Fish to do some creative thinking for the show. We get a hundred shades of fleshy mole and Josh not breaking a stream of piss while passing gas. So that's what's going through Fish's head on a regular basis, and now we just know. Yeah, yeah. A little taste of my world. <laughs> All right. <laughs> well, that's it. An interesting listeners. world. I hope the, that was as torturous for you as it was for us. Um, glad to glad to have you doing the intros, Fish. It's Merry Christmas. Thank you. C- can I introduce myself? Uh, I don't. Uh, I, guess, I guess so. <laughs> wow. This. Okay. Now he's gone too far. What is? What is this? <laughs> All right. And of course. The sexiest man in all of podcasting, and holder of the title Mr. Universe, as well as winning the Nobel Prize two dozen times, and chosen to wield the Triforce and Master Sword to save all of Hyrule. Yours truly, Anthony Fisher, aka Fish. Boo! (laughs) Wah, wah, wah. (laughs) See, if... I never... (laughs) You know, it's odd. I just heard about a fleshy mole, but somehow ma- watching someone masturbate is a little bit too far. Too much. Yeah. You, you yeah. never go full masturbate, Fish. That's the rule. Never full masturbate. Really? Okay. Yeah. Damn it. I can't just suck my own dick on this podcast? Whoa, whoa. That's a whole nother level. Josh said masturbate. Nothing about <laughs> sucking your own dick. Come on. That's a form of masturbation. That, no, no. That's self fellatio. That is, that is the next tier. Okay. Uh-huh. I've achieved it. You consider sucking your own dick a form of masturbation, huh? Wow, I, I, I wouldn't. Yeah. Um, now you're thinking with portals. <laughs> <laughs> now, we, now we're using our imagination. Um, all right, now before we get too off the rails here, um, my gift to Josh was just that every week he's always complaining that my sound is shitty. So hopefully this week... My sound will be slightly better because I built this. I put it on Instagram today. I built a wooden box, measured it out and everything, cut it out, and uh, went to the store and actually bought a foam mattress, sliced it up, glued it to the inside of the box, and my microphone is in this soundproof box. Now, I don't know if it's going to be perfect. We'll see how it goes, but hopefully I'm sounding better than normal or at least less reverby, and uh, I'm praying that Josh will yell at me less. So Merry Christmas, Josh. Hooray! Even if it doesn't work, I tried. I tried my hardest to make you happy.